This video is sponsored by Walmart Marketplace. Today, we're going to be talking about Walmart Multi-Channel Solutions. This is a game-changing tool that Walmart recently released that accompanies their Walmart Fulfillment Services. So what MCS is, is it's where you can take inventory that you currently have on Walmart and you're selling it through WFS, and you can use that inventory to fulfill orders on other marketplaces such as your website, eBay, or really anywhere. With Walmart's robust and world-class logistics services, you get affordable pricing, fast shipping, and reliability. Not to mention that Walmart helps you automate all of this and they even handle returns. So let's dive into it. So what are the benefits of using MCS versus your own shipping or just with your own warehouse? Well, with MCS, you can utilize Walmart's fulfillment services for inventory that you're currently storing there. Walmart offers competitive storage rates as well as competitive fulfillment fees. On the fulfillment fee side, currently Walmart offers two different shipping speeds. Standard shipping starts out at $7.45 and then it goes up from there. So let's say that a customer orders two items from you. Instead of paying $7.75 per a unit, instead, you're now going to go ahead and pay $5.25 per a unit. And if the customer orders three units from you, you're now going to be able to subtract $3 from each of the unit's fulfillment fees. So instead of costing you that $5.25, they're now going to go ahead and now they're going to cost you $4.25 to ship per a unit. So at scale, especially if you're shipping a lot of units that are usually ordered together, or you get a lot of orders that are multi-quantity, this is going to be an extremely affordable way to fulfill those orders. The next fee that you're going to be paying is you're going to be paying the storage fees, and this just depends on the size of your item, as well as how long you're keeping it there. On top of that, Walmart understands that different marketplaces have different requirements for branding and packaging, which is why all orders are shipped in plain unbranded packaging. Last but not least, my favorite feature when it comes to MCS is leveraging Walmart's large network to go ahead and accept and process returns. This is a big headache for me since I sell on a lot of platforms, but with MCS, I can go ahead and I can use Walmart inventory to fulfill to all the other channels and then when those customers want to return, they can go ahead and they can get a return label directly from Walmart and ship the inventory back to a WFS facility, or they can actually bring the return to a Walmart store and then Walmart will process the return back for me. And the best part is that your current existing return settings for your WFS items are already applied to these returns. So you can choose to dispose of items, you can choose to go ahead and resell them if they're in good condition, or you can choose to have all the returns sent back to you or your warehouse. Lastly, let's talk about requirements for MCS. So the only real requirement is, is that you currently need to be approved for WFS, as well as in order to have an item enrolled and use multi-channel solutions, is it needs to be a WFS item. Now let's quickly talk about how to set up multi-channel orders. So once you have an item live that is currently at Walmart Fulfillment Services and it's being fulfilled by Walmart, you can go into your dashboard and under your WFS tab, it's going to be the last option where it says multi-channel orders. From there, you can go ahead and on the multi-channel order page, you can see all of your past multi-channel orders, or you can go ahead and create a new one by either doing a single order, or you can do multiple orders and upload in bulk. For the single order, if this is your first time, you're just going to have to set it up. So you can set up a channel name inside of your settings tab. And once you set that up, you're going to see all of your channel names right here. So you can have your website, you can have eBay, or you can call them a custom name. And then you're just going to select which channel it's for. And then you're going to have your customer order number. So this can be an internal number to you. You can just do a random number. And then from there, you have the customer information. So you just fill out the first name, the last name, their phone number, whether the address is residential or commercial. Then you're gonna put in their address right here. And next you're gonna go ahead and you're going to select your shipping and items. So you can select either two day or you can do the three to five day. And then you can go ahead and you're going to select your item by putting in the SKU that the customer ordered. You can also go ahead and you can add multiple SKUs if they order different items that are in your catalog at Walmart Fulfillment Services. Once you fill in the information, you're then going to go ahead and you're gonna have the confirmation for the order where you'll see the order details, you'll see the customer information, as well as you also see the fulfillment cost. So for an expedited order for this item, which weighs 0.74 pounds, it's going to cost me $10, which is pretty comparable to UPS rates. And this is only for a quantity of one, but as you stack those quantities, you're going to see a much better rate per an item. Once you're done, you can go ahead and press submit and the order will be processed and shipped to the customer. So it's that simple to leverage MCS for your business to help you grow and scale on other marketplaces, as well as leverage your existing inventory at the WFS center. If you'd like to find more information about how you can leverage WFS or how you can get started with using it for your current inventory, be sure to go ahead and check out the link down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.